So, we're all complete now. We've got on our all the nuts and bolts on the uh, CV axle and a uh, new boot replaced. So, this is the uh, lock and tool and operation sweetest. Mount it on there and then lock it on the ground there. So, we just want you to swing around your lock. So, you can tighten up your center bolt, center nut, without the uh, need of. Didn't any assistance from anybody else, it's a job you can do on your own now, so once you have this be lock until and I'll put the link below the description if you want one of these here. And uh, there's 50 euro, uh, 40 euro, and then there's 10 pound of postage. But I think I have about 10 of them left, so it's a very handy tool if you're working on your own. Uh, can be used for locking up camshafts as well, or even crankshafts. So you can do multiple things for the middle. So very handy we totally have in the garage. So next step now is to tighten. We did tighten up the bolt there now, and that's that tighten the bolt to off the the uh, socket. We'll have to lock until we put the wheel on. And that's the job on our Saturn C5 uh, complete. So it's a fairly common uh, MOT fail. It's the uh, CV bit. It's not as easy as the other cars, but <laughs> just the way the suspension set up. It's just different suspension type from the rest, so it's just a wee bit more awkward. But once the M bolts out, once the bolts is out, uh, center bolt out here, center nut out here, and the lock on the wee lock washer and the uh, split pin out. First thing you do. Uh, off the brake caliper, just keep the caliper on the holder, just drop the holder. Two bolts down there. And uh, let me get something on. So you have two bolts down the back there. And uh, two bolts down there. Three bolts in the ball joint. Drop link off. This one off here on the uh, holder, one on the top. So just to get off there and off here, lift off the whole unit and tie it up in here to a piece of string or a piece of copper or something. Out of the way so nothing gets stretched or broken. So once that's done then, it's a straightforward job getting it out. And, and then you have to top up the gearbox while you're near finished. So that's one thing you wouldn't want to forget. So, so let's tighten up now, we'll remove these tools and this day job complete on our Southern C5 CV boot replacement. It's the same operation if you want to change the, the actual uh, CV joint on uh, Southern C5.